Hello everybody! Welcome back to another video. Today, we are going to be doing another randomized spiral abyss with the new and improved 4.5 abyss. And for a little added twist, we are going to include Chiori in one of our randomized teams because she's the newest character. And honestly, I've been having a lot of fun with Chiori. I know a lot of people don't like her, but I've actually got her on a good weapon, some good artifacts, and some good talents. So with that all being said, let's get in to today's video. But first, let's talk about the sponsor of today's video. Today's sponsor is Opera GX, which is a web browser which you can download in the link in the description below or the pinned comment. Opera GX has a bunch of different things you can do with it, including a bunch of different mods. These mods can give you things like background music, different keyboard sounds, opening and closing tab sounds, themes and colors, and more dedicated wallpapers. Opera GX now also has a native integration with Generative AI, allowing you to reap all of its benefits in a quick and accessible way by hosting of AI power tools, AI prompts, and sidebar access to ChatGBT and ChatSonic. You can also separate videos from the browser into a floating adjustable video frame, catch up with all of the upcoming shows, and work or study at the same time using this feature. It's really simple. Just click the button on the left while watching and the windowed version of the video will follow you in each open tab. Opera GX is also equipped with an import tool that allows you to quickly import all of your settings from your previous browser into Opera GX like browsing history, bookmarks, and cookies. So thank you to Opera GX for sponsoring today's video. And if you want to, you can use my link below to download Opera GX today. Alrighty, randomized spiral abyss time. This is always a lot of fun. So today I don't have much time. I'm kind of in a rush. So we are only gonna be doing floors 10 and 11 today. We're gonna start out with floor 10. And I honestly, I need some good units for floor 10 because we have these annoying specters on the second half. Okay, so this is our Genshin Impact team randomizer. It can select any unit in the game and it will be completely random. If you would like to use this site for yourself, I will link it in the description below. Let's see what units we get. Here we go. Please be good. Okay. Interesting. We have Lynette, Albedo, Yoimiya, Ketching on the first half. I think the Spectres were on the first half, so I am happy to see Yoimiya there. And then second half is going to be Ningguang, Zhongli, Razor, and Kokomi. Pretty decent teams. Let's see what we can do with them. So a lot of these units should be already built in my account. As you can see, every character that I have built, I put a little star beside them. So... For example, Albedo, already built. We got him on a Cinnabar Spindle and a four-piece Husk. Catching is going to be on a Primordial Jade Cutter and a two-piece Thundering Fury, two-piece Glad. And then Yoimiya should also already be built on a Rust and a four-piece Shimanawa. And I think the only non-built one will be Lynette. I don't think I have a built Lynette. So we will just have to quickly throw her on some stuff. So I think I'm going to put her probably on a Favonius Sword. I feel like that's definitely our best option just to get, you know, particles back and stuff like that. As for artifacts, we're probably going to want something like a four-piece Fear Descent for the obvious reason it's even recommended here. So let's just steal a good Crit Rate Hat, a good Animo Damage Goblet, and then we want like an Attack Sands probably. Yep, there's a good Attack Sands right there. Take a Feather, and we can also just take a nice little flower and just like that we have a five piece viridescent on our lynette and we also have some pretty good talents and currently my lynette is c3 could use a couple more constellations pretty good though for our second team i am going to make the executive decision to take out razor and put in chiori instead of razor and with the addition of chiori on that team that actually makes for a very strong geo team we have the combination of my built zhongli with a skyward spine and a four piece tenacity combined with my Ningguang, who is a very good DPS, who has a Solar Pearl and a two-piece Archaic Petra, two-piece Shiwanawa, and with my Chiori, who we've already showed off. And then the last character on that team is Kokomi, who is just on a very basic build, the normal healer build with a prototype Amber and a four-piece Ocean Hued Clam. So with that all being said, let's get into this abyss and start crushing some things with our randomized teams. Okay, here we go. I'm ready for this. We have a variety of elements on this first half. None that really work well together, to be honest, but we should be okay. Okay, there we go. We got him, and we're up in the sky. I hate that about Albedo so much. 
Okay, another one dead, and last one, we're done. Good stuff, on to the other side. It's Chiori's time to shine, boys, finally! Oh my goodness, look how many Geo statues we have up. We have we have the dolls, we have the pillars, and we have the Ningguang Jade Shield. And it's already over. <laughs> that was so fast. Okay, we go again. Oh god, this is the Spectres, isn't it? Oh goodness, okay, this is exactly why we brought Yoimiya, is because they're immune to her attacks. God I didn't know there was fire specters in this game. Yes, I did. I just kind of forgot about them. Their existence is a little irrelevant. Go! Oh, gosh. Nice. Two kills right there. Blow up. Blow up. Blow up already! Thank you. What are these things? Oh, the... I don't even remember the name of these enemies. It's been a while since I fought them. The fungi? Kaching burst? Tappy Lynette. Nice! You're doing actual damage, Lynette. Look at you go! Physical Lynette always gets the job done. Physical Albedo. Huh. Yeah, it actually works pretty well. 12k a hit. Damn, Albedo. Okay. Pop. Let's go. We keep moving. Chiori, it's your time. Put up all our Geo Constructs. We're going to get the most amount of Geo Constructs we can. The Geo Construct build is actually so cool. Whoop. Oh, gosh. Freeze them. Nice. I haven't even used Kakomi yet. Here, Kakomi, you can get some screen time. I, I feel kind of bad for you. Anyways, Kakomi got no screen time. Final chamber time. Here we go. And at E, and join me a burst. We have three enemies this time. Should be pretty easy. If we just group them all together, get this little crocodile out the way. I don't like him. Get him going. Get him gone. And we win. Come on. Here we go. Kokomi E, only two enemies. Are you kidding me? Who do you think I am? You think I'm a coward? Put more enemies in the abyss game. Freeze, cowards. And finish you off with the Ningguang burst. Easy peasy. Floor 10 completed. Let's go to floor 11. Okay, floor 11 time. We have a 75% geo damage bonus. That is pretty insane. So I'm hoping we get some geo characters here. All right, we're back on the randomizer. Let's generate two more teams. Let me see some big geo units. Okay, actually, we got two big geo main DPSs right there. Artok Ito, Noel, we got... M Mika, <laughs> okay. Yanfei, Kaya, Ganyu on the second half is pretty cool. And then, of course, we got the most overpowered unit in the entire game, Bennett, on the first half. Let's go build these units. So for that first half, we had, of course, our main DPS and Arataki Ito, who should just be on his best build possible, utilizing the four-piece husk and the serpent spine. Then, of course, we had Mika, who is uh, level 20, I think. Oh, wait, I level 80 him? I don't remember. <laughs> I don't even remember building this character, to be honest. I guess I did. Okay, fair enough. Uh, let's put him on some stuff then. Let's get him on Favonius Lance, obviously. What else do four-star supports even use other than Favonius? And then uh, what do you use on Mika again? I actually have no idea. You use uh, four piece noblesse and HP stuff. All right, let's get you some noblesse then. Say less. Noblesse oblige. We're going to need some energy recharge, probably. And then we're looking for HP percent goblet. We got one there. And probably crit rate hat. Boom. Done deal there. And no con. I don't have a single Mika constellation. Damn. Unfortunate Mika. We keep moving. Next, next character was Nilu, who will probably just be our dedicated nothing character because I, I mean, what can she even? do here we have our Taki Ito main dps and then bennett support so nilu will be almost completely useless but that's okay on the other half we have noel who should be already built on a white blind and a four piece retracting bull wide because she actually is like the only character that makes use of that set then we had ganyu who i don't know how useful she'll be but we're gonna make the best use of her that we can she's on a four piece wanderers and that hamayumi and then our last two characters were yanfei who is on a pretty good build right now with a doko tails and a four-piece wanderers and a kaya who we will slap on a black sword and then we can also get um what does kaya need probably like a four-piece blizzard strayer right yeah let's go four-piece blizzard i have some pretty good blizzard pieces that we can slap on him and we could just make him the most overpowered kaya the world has ever seen hopefully let's see that split Ooh, 81 137 not too bad and with that i think we have all our characters built so let's go and try floor 11 now Okay, here we go. This shouldn't be too bad this first half because we do have a couple healers here. So we should be okay, I'm hoping. Plus, we have Artaki Ito main DPS, which is pretty insane. I'm not going to lie. Let me attack you. Just get away your shield already. Thank you. Okay, we're good. Goodbye. Nice. Boom. Stupid shields, man. Move. 
Nice. Oh, we got a freeze. <laughs> I completely forgot we can do freeze with Mika and Neelu. That is the weirdest freeze comp of all time. Who wants some of all right, now it's just these goofballs standing on a ledge here. Get down from there, you clowns. Get off of the ledge. How am I supposed to get them down? Go, Nilu. Thank you. He's down. <laughs> okay, we're good. We're good. On to the other side. We keep moving. I'm just realizing this side is like literally all main DPSs, but um, we'll make it work. We'll make it work. Oh, wait, I guess Noelle can heal, can't she? Yeah, Noelle can heal. I completely forgot Noelle can heal. Boom, 13, 15. Come on, Noelle. Wait, spinner? Yeah, spinner time. Disregarding Noelle, we can just do like classic freeze comp with Kaya and Yonfei, which could be pretty good, I think. Go, Yonfei. Okay, now we switch out. Two more enemies to go. Just murder them, Kaya. Kaya main DPS, meta as hell. Shout out to all Kaya mains. One dead, one more. Come on, Ganyu. One more little shot. Boom, we did it. First stage completed. On to the next one. Nilo first. Oh my goodness, what are these lion looking things? I haven't fought these enemies before. I assume these are from the new area. I have not explored it yet. Oh God. Damn, these things have health. Oh my gosh, they have health. Why do they have so much? Holy smokes. Okay, I think we got them though. Or maybe not. We didn't kill one with Ushi and now we're just kind of screwed. Just a little bit more. There we go. We got him. Now it's just some mechs. Let's go. Should be simple enough. Just hit him, smack him with the baseball bat. There we go. One dead. One more to go. Just need a little bit more. Come on, Ito. Let's go. It's time for Noel comp now. Two opponents. Oh, you are going to make me laugh. Or maybe I shouldn't say that too soon. Oh, God. Why does it have so much defense? I can't even, like, crack 10k against this guy. Oh, God. Bro, this thing is jumping up and just doing so much crazy stuff. What is that thing? What is this? What is this? Well, it's gone now. Oh, it got him to the ground. That's useful. Why didn't I know that was a thing in the game? Learn something new every day. Okay, just a couple more Ganyu hits. Oh, God. Just run from that. There we go. He's dead. Oh, God. Not a bird. Just a little bit more. A little bit more. Yes, we did it. Stage two complete. On to the final chamber of the challenge. One more chamber to go. Let's see if we can complete floor 11 chamber three with some tainted water. What is this thing? Well, I'll tell you what. Nilu will not be helpful here. Let's go. Boom, boom, boom. Ushi, come on. Got him down to half. And again, 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 again. I don't know if we'll be able to beat it in seven minutes. It's going to be real, real tight. Okay, we need Mika Particles. Mika Particles, send them to Ito. And now we go off. Can we do it in below eight minutes 30? No, we're going to get 829, 828, 826. That's a good amount of time. But can we get the three star with this uh, team and a half? I don't even know what to describe this. We don't have too difficult of a challenge ahead of us. It is just some mechs. So I'd give us pretty good odds let's kill this one real quick this is just an easy kill easy little pick off right here kaya burst yon fei burst two more to go oh god he does damage i wish these guys would just group up just group up why are you all the way over there okay he's dead now if this guy would just come over here why are you just such a coward oh gosh we only have 12 seconds left come on yon fei come on yon fei you got this go on you go God, God, you first take so long to go off. We're not going to get it. Oh, man, we were so close, too. We should still be able to beat the challenge, though. And just like that, we are done the challenge. Two stars. We'll take it. And with that, we have finished the Random Spiral Abyss Chiori Edition. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, make sure to leave a like or subscribe down below. But with that all being said... That is going to be the end of today's video, and I'm going to see you all in the next one. Peace.